The Pharmaceutical and Molecular Biotechnology Research Centre was established in 2008 um, here in WIT. Um, it occupies approximately 700 square metres of research space and to date there's approximately 25 staff involved in the centre. The purpose of the Pharmaceutical and Molecular Biotechnology Research Centre was effectively uh, there was three key strands that we were trying to support in the centre. One uh, was uh, to support innovation in the South East uh, in terms of multinational companies, say for example, and SMEs. Secondly was uh, to support postgraduate training at Masters and uh, PhD level. And thirdly was to develop and support uh, training and partnerships with uh, EU organisations, both companies and third level organisations as well. So collaboration with industry is a significant proportion of the work that we do here in the PMBRC. Uh, the projects that we do range from small one-off contract analysis and uh, quality investigations right up to the development of new products and new technologies which are obviously more extensive collaborations. The companies we work with tend to be in the pharmaceutical and healthcare and medical device industries. Research in the PMBRC can be broken down into four areas. Our drug delivery research is aimed at delivering drugs more effectively to target sites within the body with the aim of improving the therapeutic benefit to the patient and minimising the unpleasant side effects that some drugs can have on the patient. Our biomedical research, we're looking at new biomarkers which can be used in the early diagnosis of certain diseases such as cancers and cardiovascular disease. Our pharmaceutical analysis research in the PMBRC, we're looking at separation science and analytical separations, and also using our characterization technologies to characterize drugs and excipients, um, and relating those properties to the performance of the drug in a manufacturing process or the efficacy of the final product itself. And finally, our research in molecular biotechnology, uh, we're looking at novel enzymes which can be used in the selective synthesis of certain organic molecules, which can ultimately be used in the synthesis of drug molecules.